Hi all, a uh, bit of an update here on the R2-D2 dome that I'm working on. Um, I've just been walking past it the last couple of days and I don't know, it just looks naked without his eye there. So I, uh, I modelled one up and I'm pretty happy with it. Decided to go with balsa wood, which is, as a lot of people know, very, very soft wood. But um, I can now, once I've put it together like I have, um, I can actually uh, coat this with a watered down PVA to make the surface quite hard. And then of course the layers of paint over that will also make it quite hard as well. So as you can see, I uh, rounded the back out, used the uh, Dremel for that, and did uh, the final curving of it with a piece of sandpaper over the top of the dome uh, to get the right sort of curves and as you can see it sits on perfectly I'm very happy with that um, no gaps whatsoever uh, and then I did the opposite of that put some sandpaper on the inside uh, to sand and get the curvature on the facade the face um, and then I should have just cut it out of the whole piece, but I ended up having to cut an extra bit for the side here. And as you can see, the glue's on there. It's still just setting. I'll give that a final sand lightly on the side there. Get rid of that um, fuzzy grain at the side. And yeah, then I'll get myself for the... Uh, lens I'll get myself one of those uh, Christmas baubles the acrylic dome shaped baubles you can get from craft stores and obviously spray paint the inside of it black so that it's automatically got its own gloss and shine and yeah then I'll uh, look at how I'm going to attach it to the side there um, lovely some sort of really good epoxy uh, Next step is I'm going to be working on the pie panels, pie pieces, um, and I've got some PVC plastic that I'm thin stuff that I'm going to basically with a heat gun melt over the top just slightly so that it loses its flatness and uh, curves to the top of the dome, and then I'll cut those pieces out. And then sand it back and then we've got a whole heap of spray painting to do. I'll also do the same with these side panels as well. All except for the logic areas. And I'll finish cutting out those holes there. Alrighty. I'll catch you later.